Sagittarius, thank you for tuning in to Perfectly Imperfect Tarot. This is Green Eyes here with your reading. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars, Martians, Astronauts. Pick a node. It does not matter to me. I love you all. Cross Watchers, I am a snitch. I'm telling you now. Please don't curse me in the comments. Love you too, okay? Sag, this is a judgment-free zone, but you will hear the truth. There's no gender or age, only energy. You're going to hear me use terms he, she, or him. They, them, it, have a Pay it no mind. Feel the energy. And remember the roles can always be reversed. Sag, I thank you. Like, share, subscribe, emails, comments, love tokens, donations. Thank you so very much for your support of the channel. All right, guys. Coming into your energy. I've been struggling with your energy lately. You know that? Seriously, it's so, um, it's frustration and frustration and anger and like even today coming in, there's some fear. I feel like um, I, I spoke my piece and I'm waiting for the jury to come back with the verdict. You know what I'm saying? Um, anxiety, my anxiety is high. So it's, I don't, I'm pulling from the angels and ancestors for you because this has been in my opinion, long enough. You know, you guys uh, have been in this spicy zone for a minute. And it's like now we need a divine intervention here to break up this, um, whatever it is that, you, you, uh, that you're that you in. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't like it for you. Um, and I feel like you're, how can I say that? unintentionally holding on to it as a defense mechanism you know some some people hold on to pain because it gives them power you know so let's see where this goes can i have sagittarius please sagittarius please This is you. Just holding on. Holding on. Look. Even <laughs> holding on. Hold the space. You see that? Mm, mm, mm. Medicine guardian coming in. Open to healing information. Sag, we gotta okay. I like this. Let's talk about this. The druid energy is an energy of being a person being set in their ways. You know, we all have like that person in our family and they and say that's just the way they are ignore them and they are like that and they have absolutely no intent to change <laughs> you know it's usually uh this person is normally wise they might not be that friendly but they are wise you know um and there is divine guidance here with this druid energy so if you feel like you're holding on to what's important to you, you know, as far as standing up for your right to fight, you know, fighting for your right to party or, you know, your abundance, your integrity, um, or your space, you know, in the hierarchy. Okay. Like if it's a job situation, um, then yeah, absolutely continue to do so, but do so with a glad heart. That's the difference. You know what I'm saying? Don't be upset that now, like, you have to, I have to stand again. I have to hold my space again. I have to, uh, it's like you're looking at it like you're defending yourself. And as long as what you're standing for is righteous and true, it's the righteousness and truth that's defending you. It's not you. The Most High is going to take care of that. So yes, hold that space. But again, please do so with a glad heart. Because if you're being divinely guided to stand, then stand with a glad heart. Because you know you're being divinely guided to do so. And that can only bless you in the end. Okay? Now with the Medicine Guardian coming in, um, wherever you're standing, like I said, it's it's a very uncomfortable situation. Okay? Um, so if you, you know, are 
receiving information like even off of social media or you just see a commercial, you know, of maybe a tea that would uh, calm you down or uh, taking a walk, whatever the case is, uh, Medicine Guardian usually delivers the messages of healing um, through weird, uh, unknown sources. You know, God will use anybody. You know what I'm saying? So it literally reads, be open to healing information. Okay. It doesn't have to be from somebody you know. You can literally have just a conversation in the supermarket uh about whatever you know and never know and somebody might say you know what i had that you know i tried this tea or, or i mixed lemon in this and this and this you know uh, some type of natural regimen so uh if you do get that information make sure you uh, try it okay now the water is coming in uh to help you reconnect with your emotions because you do feel like i said like you're standing in um, a space of um, that's draining you, okay? The water guardian comes in to reconnect you, to reconnect you with uh, divine love. Uh, you know, the, the love of the emotion is love, okay? Um, but water is also very fluid to get you back into the flow of life, you know, allowing uh, yourself and things to kind of just be, you know, okay, say, ra, say, ra, right? Whatever will be, will be to kind of get back in touch with the softness of you as well, okay? Uh, the hunter is coming behind that. Um, I think that whatever it is that you're going through, I feel like uh, I'm being attacked, I'm not gonna lie. I feel like it's old. And um, I don't know if you got some papers delivered from something from seven years ago, uh, but <coughs> um, there is a source of where what got this what got this going you know i don't know if somebody working at a certain company and then found your name and they're friends with such and such so they didn't put your name for i don't know an audit or investigation of some sorts it, it just it feels old i'm not gonna lie uh, but the hunter energy helps you get to the meat and potatoes of that so if this is the situation don't fret about it because the hunter is going to give you the information to track that down, okay? Also, the hunter helps you with desire. It reestablishes the fire in you so you can get back to passion, you know? So the druid, this earth energy is keeping you uh, still, right? It's holding you still. And that's not your energy because you're fire. You're on the go. But the medicine guardian will help with that. The water comes in to get you back flowing, and then we have the hunter coming in with fire. So basically, little by little, you're kind of being replenished um, with what you need so that you can get back to your true form and your true self. And um, if need be, to keep that peace, whatever. Let it go. You know? The peacekeeper is the person that doesn't need to be right they just need for i need you to be out of my face that's what <laughs> you understand what i'm saying <laughs> the peacekeeper don't need i don't need to be right but i do need you out of my face that's all i'm saying okay just keep the distance way over there and that i'm okay with that i'm i'm okay with being your villain i'm okay with that part i will not defend myself on that matter i just Talk about it over there, you, you know? <laughs> oh, all right. Let's get to your spread. Hopefully that made you smile a little bit because I miss my old Sag energy, man. Y'all ain't been fun in a minute. I don't like this. Pineapples, you know? <laughs> all right, let's pull. Yeah, let's do Pruitt's. That's whimsical. We're going to pull from Pruitt's for your spread. I feel like somebody just found out that they had a purse stolen that was in their closet and they never used it. it it's a, uh, it's been in there for years though, but you know, you, you know, it was in there. 
You know what I mean? Let me have the core for Sagittarius. What's at the center of this energy? Please and thank you. All right. Look at you. I'm a superstar. Yep. Favor, balance, um, limelight, exposure. Um, all because of who you are and where you stand with the most high. You know what I mean? The star energy is you being on stage. The spotlight is shining on you. And the most high is in the first row and says, Sanj, let me see what you got. And you just perform and do your best, you know? And coming in here with the Six of Cups with this emotional balance um, and assistance, it's a forward moving energy. Um, it's not really like super duper happy, but it is help, you know, and it is uh, forward moving because this has been giving you crap for a while, that devil energy. I don't know what's, if it's a Capricorn or, but it's an attack on your finances or your foundation, which you take extremely personal. Okay, uh, crown this energy, please, for Sag. And the Eight of Wands is crowning. If you need to make a take a quick trip, make a quick move, um, just to kind of regroup, yeah, have some fun, do it. Do it, man, do it. Why not? If you can afford it, do it. Go, go. Because, you know, sometimes that's just what we need to decompress, to get your mojo back. Okay, Eight of Wands is also an energy of downloads might be coming in like crazy. What's working against Sagittarius, please, right now? What's in the way? Death. Okay, so some of you, I have to say, of course, with death energy, might be struggling processing grief. You're fighting it, Seven of Wands, because you don't agree with it or... Um, it, you know, how can I say that? You don't agree with it. It's like, um, you didn't see it coming or, um, even if you did see the transition coming, maybe now that the transition happened, that was the glue that held the family together. So now the family is acting cuckoo, whatever it is, it's an energy that's just, you know, death energy is death and rebirth. Okay. So it's something that needs to be let go of which is that peacekeeper just to let it go let go of the need to be right um that needs to be released and but you're fighting the release okay yeah maybe with a libra or taurus you and libras man all the time god darn i'm oh where's this coming from boomstick i like that You've been really trying to move forward, trying to be moved with purpose, focused. Expectations are nice and high. You've been doing your own thing. It's like this came out of nowhere. And it's holding on to you like a mother lover or you're holding on to this. You know, I want to clarify this. I'm sorry, Sedge. If you don't mind, I don't mean to um, make this any longer than it needs to be, but... I want to know why you guys have been in this energy for so long. I just feel like it's been long enough. Because I know it's not all of you, but somebody obviously is still going through this. So just give me a second. I want to clarify that death and see how and why it's working against you so hard. Because you were in a great space. We've been having fun with your readings. You know, all right, clarify death working against Sagittarius, Clarif betrayal, God darn it, this, Sag, I don't know what the, y'all got to stop with this shit, man, I love you, but, woo, when it comes to loyalty and betrayal, you don't play, I, I, it's like, I don't know what it does to you, why this is a, a it's like, a major button for you loyalty betrayal you know that's why i call y'all secret squirrels because don't let nobody tell somebody else what color socks you got on 
you want to act like they didn't gave out your damn social security number. You know, it's, you got this. <laughs> Sage, I love you, but this has got to, you got to get a hand. Look at, look at the conflict that it causes. It's the betrayal. It's some kind of betrayal or backstab or paperwork or foolishness. And it's causing this big ruckus. And you were trying to be your best self for a while. But here comes the foolishness with the okie doke. But it's messing with either your foundation or your money. You know, like somebody trying to stake a claim on something, your work, your house, your finances. And it ain't nothing but this mother love here just coming to disturb your peace. When you was trying to take a nap, you was trying to manifest. You understand what I'm saying? So, yeah, uh, every time in the past you might have an apologize and somebody else may have apologized. And then you go back to yourself and then here come another. Did you hear such and such was talking about you? And you're like, well, dag, here we go again. Now you got to pull the sword out and go check another mother lover. Why is you talking about me again? Every time I try to make it work and we say we work it out. You know, and I'm getting away from the toxic mess and I'm trying to be loving, but here come the foolishness again, again, like I cannot, it's like you can't get a break and I'm tired of it at this point and I ain't even no damn sag, but this, because this keeps happening, let me say this sag, because this keeps happening, okay, you got to let a fool be a fool. Sometimes, unless like unless you're really defending like your you holding on to your coins, you know, somebody something like that, that's different. But if this is not directly affecting your finances, your home, your family, you know, I would just say you, you if you can, if you can, just do that over there. Just go over there with that. I don't even want to hear it. Go over there with that. You, you know, just do it from over there. Talk about me on the other side of the street. Th that's all I ask. And if this is somebody in your family, in your home, because I know you've, um, there's some children here. For some of you, this is your child. Then we have to, um, we got to re 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 revisit the ground rules. You know, we got to regress, but that's all. Re revisit the ground rules. Okay, in this house, what we're not going to do is this. In this house, this house right here, we're not going to do that. All right, I'm going to do my part, and this is what I'm going to do. You're going to do your part, and this is what I expect from you. Revisit the ground rules, all right? Where are we going with this for Sagittarius? Please and thank you, because I miss my Sag. Over here stressing out my damn Sag. Yeah, look at you. Five of Cups. This is you feeling everything I just said. Like, I'm tired of this. Every time I sit down, here we go again. Here we go again. Here we go again. You know, that's this energy here. You're getting ready to do exactly what I just said. Um, but the victory is still yours. You know? Now, you might have some shoulda, coulda, wouldas it doesn't change the fact that the victory is still yours. All right. Um, you're still the boss. You're still in control, emperor energy, and you're still you, Sag, temperance. Okay. Uh, going forward, I feel like I feel a permanent shift from this. I'm not going to lie. Somebody really has changed the dynamic with you probably for life. You know, I feel I'm, I'm very wounded from this. I'm not in my chest. So uh, you're going to see somebody completely different and you're going to move different. You know, your intuition is telling you that you have to, you have to, all right. Um, you have to start over. You have to move different. You have to treat them different. You have to protect yourself differently. Things like that. Okay. Full energy, you know, is new beginnings. Now, if therapy um, is on the table, absolutely. Why not? All right. But for teamwork to make a dream work, remember, that's no different from what I was just saying with revisiting the ground rules. 
of the home, of, of the space that you share if you share the space, you know? That, that would be a three, pen, three of Pentacles energy as well. Revisit those ground rules. Revisit those boundaries. Revisit um, your expectations um, and let them do the same so that we can put it into this because it has to stop. It has to stop. We got to close out this cycle, you know? Um, of course, because you're, you're Sag, you always go into work mode whenever you guys get um, worked up because it really, I know it helps you. I don't know why, but it does. Um, so I'm okay with this, but you have a problem with this um, betrayal. You know, you're working on, remember I was saying it has to stop. It seems like that's something you're working on already, but it's hard. <laughs> ten of swords to the ten of wands. <laughs> you're like, look, I'm trying. I'm trying to, I, I really don't want to be like that, but I'm, I'm trying to stop, but it's hard. But here comes strength. Look, Ten of Swords, Ten of Wands to strength. All right? So how you do that, embodying that strength, you embody the Empress. You know who you are. You know where you stand. You know your birthright. And you know that um, the God in you is greater than anything that this flesh suit can put you through. You understand? So as you do that, you look at you. You get an Uber. That's the most high sending you an Uber. Come on, Sag. Let me get you out of here. All right? Where you want to go? And that's all you have to do. Set your intentions. And it looks like you've already done it. I just want to be happy. Ten of Cups. And the chariot is taking you right to that. All right? Why not? Right? It's about time. Yeah, let's get back to some love. I love well, I love when y'all get in this Queen of Cups. So as, I swear, as much as y'all get on my nerves sometimes, you are the most loving, loving, loving energy. Even the water signs, I know. But when you get to this... It's a different kind of uh, connection. So I love this for you. Yeah, some of you, you're just battling with this Libra um, or Aquarius or Gemini. But um, you just got to move different. It is what it is. This is going to bless both of you. Whoever this is in your life, it's going to bless both of you. Okay? When you do things differently, be open to trying something new. Be open to listen. And um, it seems like this person is ready to do the same because a Queen of Swords energy is somebody that's ready to talk and tell the truth, okay? So once everybody moves to just make a small change of doing something different, Page of Wands, look, look, blessing, reward, good job, okay? The, here comes somebody running their mouth again. God darn, I'm so sick of this. I am so sick of this, look. Somebody coming and communicating something that's going to get stuck in your head <sighs> all the time. And as so, soon as you're sitting pretty, minding your business. Didn't I say it? <clears throat> I be, I'm with you, Sag. I'm not justifying nothing. I'm with you on this. I see it. I know why you're frustrated, why you feel the way you do, but it has to stop. If you know that you're dealing with an enemy that's nonstop, then you have to be nonstop on um, protecting your peace, you know? And the enemy don't sleep. So you're getting your angels and ancestors are coming in to help you with that. But it seems like this enemy just likes to plant small seeds, this page of pentacles here, to mess with your confidence and power, to get you off your square. Mother lover. All right. Look, going into confusion now, messing with your um, abundance, messing with your vibration, messing with your frequency, having you deal with karmic lessons over and over. Yeah, th thank you for this tower, because Lord knows, this, I'm happy to see this tower. Yeah, and a, okay, and a blessing with that, yeah. So you have a divine uh, intervention coming in with the tower, scorpion energy, to um, restate, reclaim, redeem. You know, and justice is coming through as well. And it's going to hurt. I ain't going to lie. I don't feel like the, it may even earlier. Remember, we had the six of wands with this five of cups. It's like a um, you, you still you got the victory, but there's still sadness. And here you get abundance and justice, but there's still sadness. So however this is working, it just seems to be a double edged sword. You know what I mean? Oh, but God is still God. You hear me? And ain't nothing too hard. Nothing, nothing, nothing. But 
we, we want to try to get you um, back to you, you know? So right now you're getting some beautiful special attention to help you with all of this that's been going on because I see you, Sag. I see you, you know? All right. I hope this helps, guys. Now, if any event you say, listen, green eyes, I heard what you said on Leo video yesterday. I didn't think that was funny. All right. Um, and this is not for me. I'm okay with that. I love you anyway. I do. But please check your moon arising. Don't take this energy. If it's not for you, leave it here for someone else. Okay. Everybody, thumbs up, subscribe. Make sure you're notified of future readings. It's absolutely free and it supports the channel. Okay. Remember, guys, we are all perfectly imperfect. I'll talk to you next time. Bye.